Hey everybody, this is Jason here. I have a problem with this virtual DJ and I have a solution. Um, I went to go do a small gig for her family this last weekend and this was happening. Video was freezing up. Uh, it's been a little while since I've done music videos but um, yeah, I went to go do it and it kept locking up on me so I just shut the screen off and just played regular music. But you'll notice that everything is going like it should be. Music's playing, but video's froze, and sometimes it does like this jittery thing. And on the screen here, it's completely frozen. But now, if you go, if you go into the configure, and then you go to video and you turn off hardware acceleration it'll come back up but oops, hold on here hmm oh wow that's weird for some reason it's not letting me even with the hardware acceleration off it's not letting me use uh... Oh well, but you notice with the hardware acceleration that it is slower and you don't get the uh, nice transition effects as if you were to have the hardware acceleration on. Now the problem that I figured out that it's with NVIDIA video cards in your PC even when I had, um, when I was using this this guy right here, I used to be my old DJ computer. It's a rack mount PC, but now I use it hooked up to this um, TV. I see it just froze up again. Here, well, I'll kind of show you what it does. We'll go back into it. Let's see if it'll do it. So if you don't have the hardware acceleration on, you don't get this video transition. Oop. Yep, just did it. Froze. Now I, I can even go back. Right there, even this side froze up. Completely locked up. Still does its, uh, the effects. Um, this doesn't affect karaoke for some reason just the music video portion okay now I'm gonna show you how to fix this alright first you'll have to figure out we're gonna get out of this you gotta shut the program down and you're gonna go to start down here then type in R E G E D I T it's registry edit you're gonna go into that you're gonna get this to pop up ask you are you sure yep okay now you're gonna have to go to you'll notice in the top here oops sorry I'm trying to look at right here you'll click on this current user and then you'll go down to the other just click on current user hit the drop down tab I hit the other drop down tab where it says software and then scroll down to where it says virtual DJ click on virtual DJ now what you're gonna do is you're gonna change a couple things in the registry and you're gonna scroll scroll down to where it says video now for some odd reason this uh... it doesn't give virtual DJ any memory to use so we're gonna change free memory right here 
you click on it now this pop-up thing comes up hit decimal okay right there now this is for my computer you have to figure out how much video RAM you have my laptop right here has two gigs of video RAM dedicated not shared it's dedicated so if you have a PC that has one gig of RAM you may want to put in like 900 inside here or something okay now that's that's video RAM free okay now max RAM use now you'll notice in the side here it has zero that's a big problem so we're gonna open that I'm gonna go into decimal now I have two gigs of RAM which equals out to like 2024 or whatever megabytes but I'm gonna give it about 800 I'm not gonna max it out 800 megabytes is plenty of information okay then hit OK now next thing you'll have to do is go down to video YV12 bug and this is a, just a binary right now it says false and you're going to turn it to true so put a 1 and you're going to turn it on basically okay so the three things you changed right here video memory free max video memory max use and then video YV12 bug okay now you'll notice in the side here that changed and this is for my computer because I have two gigs of RAM but I am only using 800 megabytes and then turn this on okay now I'm going to close it out right here close it out and I'm going to do a reboot just to just to make sure that everything stays stays how it should so I'll go ahead and restart it then at the same time I'm going to shut this change this stuff back let it do its thing TV's off it's kind of weird how that comes up there alright bear with me and don't take too long for it to boot back up Don't look at my password. Okay, wait for it to finish loading up here. That's my one jump there. Wait for it to all its little icons to pop up. Reading the hard drive, the external drive right here. Go ahead and turn this stuff back on. Alright, linked. Linked. Okay. Now I'm going to check here. It's reading everything. Okay, now I'm gonna open up Virtual DJ, and hopefully everything took. <clears throat> oh, just to make sure, I'm gonna go back into Registry Edit. So.
Okay, it's still stayed in the uh, virtual DJ area. Okay. Alright, still stayed. And video debug, okay. That looks good. Now, I'm going to tap here, go into video, and we're going to activate it. And, okay. Now, hardware acceleration is on. So, we're going to go go to videos. I'm going to give you a little something to look at here. There we go. Nice and smooth. Shake it. here and that's the problem solved and it's nice and responsive <laughs> jump smokers I'm not going to play it on music video or music because uh, YouTube likes to mute this stuff, so I'll do it myself and mute it. But everything's working good, and that's how you get rid of your little problem. Hope this helps. Practice and enjoy. Oh, well, yes, before I uh, let you guys go. Um, I always looked on the internet and I was on the Virtual DJ Forum website and they had a video discussion board on there about video freezing and there was all kinds of talk about the memory issues and stuff like that and to get memory management software. Uh, I downloaded free trials of this stuff and it did not work for me at all and I wasn't going to waste my money by buying the 16 or $20 version of it for something that didn't even work the first time. So, a simple little fix here for free and works perfectly fine. So, save yourself some money and go through your registry and do it yourself instead of getting the memory tools that did not work for me at all. So, just to save you a little bit of time and headache and downloading all that crap. And because I had to remove all that stuff and downloading the free version gave me some extra shit in my computer that I didn't want. So, alright, practice and enjoy again.